Hello everybody, I am the Black Sigma, or you could just call me Eric, and welcome back to Oracle of Ages. Hey, what took so long? My raft is ready, come over here. Okay. Uh... Oh. Not gonna talk to me again? Give me a tutorial on how it... That's a pirate ship. I'm sure it won't be important later. I mean, why would it be? Um, what's over here? Hmm... Uh, complete that end. Noted. In that case, I will sail... north? And... Oh, cutscene. I didn't do that movement. Uh-oh. Seems like we've got a bit of a storm going on. Some wild winds, blowing my raft off course. That's... there are monkeys flying around and... struck by lightning. Not the first time. Hey, little lizard guys, do you... Hey, th that's my stuff! You can't just... They stole my stuff. Well... Hmm... You there. I found this by the sea. It was next to a toke with no tail. Hey, you don't have a tail either. I'd like it if my inputs didn't drop out occasionally. I think it's probably due to my Switch's position and the Joy-Con being Bluetooth things. Hope that fixes it. Oh, is this? Um, take this. I don't need it. Thank you. That's all I picked up, but maybe the other Toke took stuff too. Maybe not. You should look around. Well, I didn't go in this cave earlier. Hey, that's my sword. Give me my... I can't push the boulder twice. Hmm. Wait a minute. I see. These are patches of dirt. Even though the dark grey makes them look kinda like rocks, they're the same shape as those mounds of dirt you can dig. So in that case, we go around this way. Hey you, give me that sword. Come on. That's all you picked up. Noted. And I'd like to switch those items. Because the sword is always mapped to the B button, and I can't push these in a way that'd be effective without jumping that gap. Gotcha. Just gonna dig the beach for potential monies while I'm on my way around the island. And this way, rocks that I can't lift. Okay. Hmm. And if we do some digging. Just a couple rupees. Whatever, it's fine. Buy something! A shield for 50 rupees? Okay. I have a funny feeling I probably could have gotten mine back normally, but... Well... I don't actually know for sure. May as well just take the first shield that comes up. Oh, all of these are diggable? But you can't dig the rocky ground texture in, um... Caves. Huh. Eh, whatever. As long as I get some of those rupees back. And push this seed up to the spot where it clearly goes. Kill the lever. And over here... Hmm... 
Oh, shop. Selling me my own items. That's the hoop I found. I'll trade it for 10 cent seeds. I don't have a pouch to carry any. You don't have them? Then I'll trade you for your shovel. Sure. Temporary trade to make some progress? Why not? Ignore that. Hmm. Let's see. Got locations I can use bombs. Uh, looking in that cave, there wasn't anywhere I could go even with power bracelet. Like, I could go up a ledge, but it wouldn't get me anywhere. This looks like it'll get me somewhere, though. Hey, bombs! I'm on the other side of this fence, which has, uh, little cuckoo chicks. Uh, that's the house that I walked past on the beach. But now that I have bombs... Ow. Wow, a geisha seed! I... haven't seen anywhere to plant one of those. Yup. Uh, where else can I go? Before I check off to the left there... There was that one toke near the start. Yep. Up and right. Do you have anything cool to say? This is our precious tree nursery. Uh, for scent tree was planted there long ago. It, it, it did, it did grow. Or rather, he'd plant it now. But, uh, scent trees take, like, a hundred years to grow. If only I had my harp. And... Do some bombing. And... Hey! You! Those are my flippers! I... I need those in order to get to you from where I'm currently standing. Can you... Can you toss those over here? Those are mine! You can't just... keep them! Hello? Okay. Instead... Where else can I go? I see my harps over there, but I can't do much about that. And that's still my bombs. And I can't swim, so I can't go down there. Hmm, I see. If I jump that pit and loop around, I can make a little bit of progress towards my flippers. Oh, I can also bomb this cave. Welcome to the Wild Toke, the game room for all fit Toke. Today's prize is this. If you want this scent seedling, which I will need in order to buy my items back, take the Wild Toke challenge, 10 rupees. Okay, wanna hear the rules? Sure. Pass meat to each Toke that runs by on the left or right. Uh, if you miss even one, you fail. Okay. Yup. And yep. Yep. What the? As if I missed you, red guy. There we go. Oh. And the red guy's the last guy. Congratulations, take the prize. Scent seedling. Lovely. Uh, in that case, I'll go talk to the guy who's going to plant that so I can get scent seeds back in the future. And then... 
I'll do the jumping puzzle. You, sir. Planter Scent Seed. Yep. Cool. Yeah, it's not gonna get big right away. Takes a long time to become a tree. Don't worry. I'm fine with that. You, I'd like to trade my power bracelet for... Sure, give me my shuffle back. And shovel for the feather. Yep, yep. Then I jump over here. Loop around here. Then throw bomb across this gap. Then I can jump it. Yep. Can't do that right now. Can do for this. Hmm. Yeah, this is fine. My menuing skills have improved. My parkour skills have not. Yep. Yep. Give me those flippers, please. Yep. Thank you. Now, we swim. But swim to where? Well, it would be over there if I had my power bracelet again. But that's fine, because now I can swim. I can do the swimming portion of that underwater section. Which I need my power bracelet to access. Ugh. Now I can swim over here, pick this up, and dive in here. Is this... just the other end of... the same room? No, it's not. Okay. So this probably leads to the staircase in the corner of the room. That it does. Which leads to... My seed satchel! Well, I need that if I'm going to use scent seeds to buy stuff. Hang on, do I have any scent seeds in my bag already? I don't. So I will need time to pass. Well, that's okay. I'll just go through this cave. Dive down here. And this sure is a lot of parkour for a guy who doesn't have his feather. Huh. Actually, there was something else I would need my feather in order to do. I clearly can't get to the harp without both. Wait, that wouldn't make sense. Um, anyway, give me the feather back for now. Wait. Oh. My feather cost mystery seeds, but... He'll trade me the shuffle for the power bracelet, but... Okay, never mind. I thought they both cost 10 cent seeds because I was skipping through text. But no, one item for mystery seeds, the other item for scent seeds. Gotcha. So I can get to my harp now. Yep. Which means I'll be able to buy that shovel back. And... Was that all my items? Hang on, I can't... No, I can't jump high enough out of water to just nail that instantly. Would have been cool if I could. And... Yep. 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 And... 
Hello, sir. Would you mind giving me my harp back? Yeah. Thank you. Hmm. Strange that item jingle played there. I can't access that warp, though, because... I don't have my shovel, but I can access the warp back on this side of the island. But before I do that, I have some parkour to do. To open the chest back here. Yep, 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 yep. Thank you, A-Press. Let's try that again. There we go. And... chest. It's another geisha seed. Really... not quite what I was hoping for. Hmm... Then back to that shop we go. And... with the help of some Time travel. We warp back to the future. I'm going to make that joke every time, aren't I? What's in this house? Ah, the cuckoos are fully grown. Incredible. There wouldn't happen to be a stairway directly back to, um... There is not. I'll have to go around. But has anything taken up the Wild Toke game? Wild Toke Museum. We Toke used to play here long ago, but not anymore. The ones on... the left... right... They're not real, they're just real looking. What won't respond if I talk to them, huh? I think they might be real guys just standing very still. here. Hello. Have to cook dinner for all the toke, but by those is all stubbed up. I, if I cook, it will taste awful. I need a super strong scent to clear out nose. Oh. So, if I throw a scent seed at you, it'll act like a uh, vapor rub or what have you to clear the nose. Okay. Hey you, listen to me, it takes a long time for trees to grow, same for the vine I climbed down. Yeah, no, I, I figured, thanks. Yep. And scent seeds! Woo! Do I have ten of them? I have eighteen. That's more than enough. Now I can go back to the past and get my shovel back, but first, since this dude asked so nicely, have... Yep. Yeah. Did that... Why... Why didn't that work? It's... It's, it's right under you, man. Come on. Well, if scent seeds don't work, I, I'm at a loss. Oh. 
once again, I could warp to the future, but there are- well, past, but there are places I can go otherwise. Vines that I made grow for some reason or another. Get in a lot of jingles to indicate places where I'll be able to plant geisha seeds. But what are the odds that I ever actually come back here to obtain said planted things? And you know, there used to be a staircase here, but I don't have a shovel to dig for it, if it were still there. I do kind of want to explore the beach though. It's a big old beach. Crab. Oh, I can't. Can't reach further left in this current time. Understood. Well, back to the past to buy my stuff back. Hello, ten cent seeds for my shovel. Or rather, you'll trade it and then I have to buy the power bracelet. Yay! It's all my items. Now what? There must be some way to reach the dungeon. Oh yeah, I have to dig the spot over here. And now that we are back here, we do a dig, and we do a time travel. Back to the future, but on the western part of the island that was inaccessible due to forest. Hmm, there's crabs, there's a cave, a fairy fountain. Well, that's great, but I was uninjured, so it doesn't matter. Crab. Crab. And more crab. Even more crab. Hmm. Another time travel spot. And as we loop around, we enter... Level 3, Moonlit Grotto. And I will begin on said Moonlit Grotto in the next episode. Bye.